hi there it's raj in this video i will show you how to transfer files directly between an ios and android device for this you need to download and install some apps from app store and play store one such app is zapya z a p y a for file transfer and sharing it is available for both ios and android devices similarly there are apps like Theme, F W -E M, Share It, Sender X E N D E R, Sapia, and Send Anywhere. I had issues with Send Anywhere, so the links of these apps are given in the video description. Now I will demonstrate how these apps transfer files directly or locally with the help of Sapia. In general, these apps uses the Wi-Fi Direct Transfer feature of the Android device. The Zapia in the Android device will create a password protected Wi-Fi network. You can see the Zapia has created a Wi-Fi network and generated a QR code with the details of the Wi-Fi network. Yeah, now you need to connect your iOS device to this network by either scanning the QR code and connecting the device by going to the settings of the iOS device choosing the Wi-Fi and then connecting to the network using the password shown below the QR code now tap join once joined you can switch back to the Zapia app. You will hear a confirmation sound that the communication is successful. Now you can send and receive files between the iOS and Android device. So you can see the file is being transferred from the Android device to the iOS device. Similarly, you can send the files from the iOS to the Android device. So now let's see another app, the sender XENDER. So here you have to create a group from the Android device and then connect the iOS device to this network so some of these apps will auto connect the ios device to the wi-fi direct network you don't need to go to the settings of the ios device for performing the connection sometimes you might need to enable the hotspot in your android device Tap on the device and you are done. You can transfer the files to and fro. Now let's see another app, the theme, F W -E M. So the best part I loved in this app was that this app generates names automatically for the device. Baby cow, such funny names. So here also the Android device creates a Wi-Fi network and you have to connect the iOS device to this Wi-Fi network using the password shown. Once the connection is successful, you can transfer the files. Another thing to keep in mind is that not all files are natively supported by the iOS. So make sure you have the necessary apps to play or open the files. However, I was slightly disappointed 
by the ads shown in the Vim app for upgrading to the Pro version. Finally, I was successful to transfer the files directly using these apps except the Send Anywhere which failed to create a Wi-Fi direct network. But the Send Anywhere worked flawlessly using the internet. So those were some apps which can transfer the files directly between an iOS and Android device using the Wi-Fi direct network created by the Android device. Hope this video was informative. Peace.